Hi, I'm Vaso and this is Kat. So today's clip um, will show you all the difficulties arising when measuring EEG. And Kat uh, will very kindly demonstrate this by measuring my EEG. As you can see, I've got all the electrodes already placed on my skin. And I want to ask you, what exactly are you going to measure here? Yes, so today we're going to try and measure your EEG between FP1, which is located on your forehead on the left-hand side, okay. and A1, which is on the mastoid behind your left ear. So we're just going to record the EEG between mm -hmm. those two with our bioamplifier. Okay, and just to remind you that, again, we've got our differential amplifier here with its three inputs. Uh, the first one's a positive, negative and ground and the signal that i can see on the screen is that my eeg now well it could be your eeg but the problem with eeg <laughs> is that there's other signals that we could be recording as well so mm -hmm. things like emg which is your muscle activity and your eye movements and movement of the leads in the amplifier as well right okay so we can demonstrate this by like looking at these individually. So EMG, we can kind of show you what that looks like stronger. So if you move your facial muscles, like smile or do some okay. expressions, and we'll be able to see the EMG signal a lot stronger. <laughs> <laughs> that's good. Yeah, so we're seeing, we're seeing a much stronger signal now on top that's like 10 to 100 times larger than we would expect your EEG signal to be. Right, so just basically the smile has completely overshadowed the EEG, yeah? Yeah, that's right. Um, what other artefacts do we have apart from this then? Okay. What else can we show? Well, we can show the eye movement artefact quite simply. Okay. Um, so if you just look up and down, right to left, we should be able to see again a change in the signal. Yeah, you can see a change again. So we've demonstrated two artefacts now. Mm -hmm. We can try and reduce these and try and now see a bit of your EEG. Hopefully. Okay. Uh -huh. <laughs> we'll have you relax completely, try not to move any facial muscles and try not to look around the room, try to fix on a point and just kind of completely relax and hopefully we'll remove all the EMG on the signal and we'll see something closer to what we'd expect your EEG to look like. Can I, can I measure some other movement, like say, yeah. <laughs> move my head and see what that does? Yeah, if you move your head from side to side, right. we're getting movement of the, um, of the electrode leads. And our bioamplifier, it's mm -hmm. a differential amplifier, as you said before. Right. So we've, we're constantly bombarded with electrical signals in our environment. And our differential amplifier, it's got the positive and negative, and it's finding the difference between the two to remove these signals. Uh -huh. But when you're moving and you're moving the electrode leads, it can't effectively do this. Uh -huh. So we're getting movement and, it, and then we're getting it in our signal as well. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Okay. <laughs>